to my brothers and my sisters. Hello, hello, hello. Back again, back again. Um, with another word, with another word of encouragement, something to get you to um, ponder on. Something to get you to um, pay attention to. And um, I've been mentioning, and man, no, many others, other um, ministers, teachers, gifted ones have been mentioning um, about this is a season and hour of um, exposure. Exposure, also manifestation. Because anytime in harvest time, something is manifest. The weed and the terror. And what I want to say, people oftentimes, they mention the word exposure and they've been referencing exposure in a negative sense. But I want to show you a different light of exposure that God is bringing to pass and uncovering it, it, to expose to is to uncover something that's secret, something that's hidden, something that's not hadn't been seen. And to expose something is not always to expose something bad. We expose something bad, but you also expose something or also uncover something good. And what I mean by that, the scripture says that what you do in secret when you pray, go in your secret closet. And what you do in secret, God is going to reward you openly for. And so what you're doing in secret, then God will reward you openly for what you're doing in secret. Then that's exposure. God is exposing uh, your faithfulness. God is exposing uh, your relationship. God is exposing uh, the revelation that he's given to you. God is expressing through you. And so exposure also is for God to uncover, to, to, to bring light to, um, to make aware of. And many of you that many things that you've been faithful in, faithful doing secretly, God is about to expose. And in that, God is about to elevate. God is about to reward for your faithfulness concerning the things that God has for you. And so the wheat and the tares, the separation is coming, the pain is coming, exposure, exposure in the wheat as well as the tares. And so just know that good things are on the horizon. And those are my words.